Hey guys, welcome to my page, DIY Crafts with Dar. Happy Saturday. How is everybody? Today is the last day of my craft show. We're going to do something pretty quick. Um, inking takes a little bit of time, but um, really it's pretty quick to get this done um, from start to finish. So, and we're just doing it all one color. How is everybody? Happy Saturday. We are going to do this on the back of a shirt for me to wear to the craft show. <laughs> So it's a little bit cold. Um, I don't know why. We're just having weird weather. So it clouded up and, and we had um, flash flood warnings and all of that. <laughs> so we're okay in the area we're at and the church actually is really, um, the drainage is really good. So no problem there. But there's areas that are probably, that probably got flooded last night. So anyways, trust God and chill. So I, I love that because Sometimes we just need to put our trust in him. And I was talking to a friend yesterday who actually is a pastor at um, a church and just told me I just need to put my faith in God with um, with Chloe and, and forgive and all of that. So I really am going to work towards that. Um, if she's meant to come back, she will. It's just I, I can't put all the focus in every day like I do. It's just it's not good for me so I've done all I can do I just need to put my trust in God so um anyways I love flannel shirts who else who else loves flannel shirts and they're just they're just so soft and this one is so cute this purple it is it's really really comfy too so it's um it's not as big as I as I would like it to be I like them to be a little bit looser but um you know maybe in time <laughs> time if Darlene puts the work in it'll get looser so anyways we're gonna put on the back I I think it's gonna be super cute on the back of here we will put a um a ink mat in there to hold it so we'll go right be right below the yoke part I think that's what it's called the yoke and um and get that done so if you're out there watching just say hi it's not my normal time on a Saturday but I have to um tear down from the craft show at three o'clock and it will be taking me at least three hours to do that because I have the checkout room and everything to do so um anyways it is a it's a long process at the craft show and um there's me and another crafter we're always the last ones out of the building because we just have so much so um I won't be available this afternoon to do my Facebook Live. So tomorrow I will, though. Tomorrow I'll do a project in the late afternoon, 4 o'clock-ish, <laughs> evening, whatever you want to call it. So um, if you're out there watching, just say hello. I know there's not as many on a Saturday. And I do want to show you something. I got a cute little present from a friend who did her front porch pickup, and I wanted to show you that. So... Um, hang on, let me just share this to my VIP group. Let me put my volume down because I know it is up. And I came home and I, I was tired. My first thing I have to do is count the money, figure out how we did for the day. And um, we did good. You know what? We, we are missing some key crafters that um, sell items that are pricey, okay? I, our jewelry people. <laughs> so we're, we are missing... Um, three jewelry people and jewelry is um, a lot more money and sells really well and so our our sales were down from last year but as far as probably I mean we I just filled spots and did some blended areas as far as per crafter I think everybody did really good so I'm not going to complain at all <laughs> so our numbers are about the same as the year before. You know, it's a roller coaster ride. You never know what it's going to be like, right? So um, I'm going to leave myself out of the corner again because I do want to make a, um, a video out of this. So I shared that to VIP. Let's see who's here. Hi, Deb. How are you, sis? Hey, Kathy. Good morning. Um, hi, Nicholas. How are you? Hi, Betty. Hi, Linda. Hi, Eileen. Good morning, Michelle. Hi, Karen Romanco. Hello, Sandy. Hi, Tina. Okay, I want to show you what my, my sweet friend um, gave me. So I, I came home to a package on my porch, and this is from Cindy. So um, Cindy, Cindy Tips, um, she picked up her order, <laughs> and she sent me this sweet card, and she says, Hi, Darlene, just a little something that I saw at the store and just had to get it for you. Thank you for your fun, knowledgeable, and funny tutorials. They bring me such joy. Love, Cindy T. And um, it says, Mama needs more coffee. I 
always need more coffee. It says the same thing on the other side. Isn't that cute? I absolutely love it. Inside, it's kind of plaid. <laughs> uh, I have never seen a coffee cup that was colored inside like that. And then to fill up that cup, I have a Starbucks gift card. So thank you, Cindy. That was really sweet of you. Look at how it's a cute little heart. I've never seen a heart shaped one. <laughs> so lots of fun. So um, I don't know where I left off there. Hi, Tina. Hi, Marilyn. Hi, Karen West. Good morning, guys. We're going to make a shirt for me to wear to the craft show. Okay, so easy peasy, guys. I'm going to grab an ink mat. This is one that's been cut. This ink mat is normally larger. I'm not going to put myself in the corner. I want to make this into a tutorial so that um, I can share how to do inking. Okay, so this is this is an ink mat that I want to put behind here. So I'm going to flip my shirt over and I'm going to put it on the back side and try to get this centered. I wish I had a great big area so that I could absolutely do this easily, but I'm going to try to figure this out. Okay, so I want to put it right below the yoke and I want it to be centered. Okay, so I'm going to try to get this flat as can be and center the ink mat. <laughs> so my friend, um, my friend Sandy has been working my booth for me and she has been having fun creating things. So if you're coming to the craft show, just ask her for a little demo. She's been making all sorts of things. <laughs> and Sylvia has been kind of helping her with stuff or giving her some ideas. They're, they're friends and it's great. Her booth is right around the corner from where my booth is. So um, Sandy will be there doing demos all day long and I will be in the checkout room. So if you come to see me, that's where I am. Okay, I'm gonna flip it over and then I'm gonna figure out where is my center, okay? So a way to figure out where your center is is to fold in half, which I should have done before, but let's see if I can do this. <laughs> let me take let me take the seams right here and let's see where our center is. Okay, so center, um, center is right here. Okay, so this is the center. So that, that line, that's perfect. Okay, so that line is the center. I want to kind of center uh, this, make sure that we are not like off to the side. It's okay if it's not perfect. And I'm gonna just gonna use white. I think white will show up really well on here. I thought about bleaching this out, but guys, I just don't have time to do that. <laughs> I just don't have time. So I'm gonna center this right in here. This is about the center. And you don't have to peel I mean, you do have to peel this off. You don't have to fuzz your transfer. So peel your transfer off of here. And I'm gonna squish this up so you can see it better. Let me just move my little thing over. And you're just gonna plop it down on there. So I'm gonna center it with this. This was the center up here. And then I'm gonna take a look and make sure that that looks like it's the center. It does. Okay, so, so um, maybe a little bit over. Oh yeah, so see this line right here? That line, we're gonna we're gonna go with that line. So we're gonna go right here, like this. And then I'm gonna look at this. That looks about right. Okay. And I think I want to be about right there. Maybe I want to be. Yeah, that's fine. I was gonna say I want to be higher. No, that's good right there. I'm good right there. Okay. So get all your air bubbles out. That's the first thing to do. Is get all the air bubbles out. You can just kind of go down with a with a squeegee. And then we're gonna put our ink on there. We will dry it and then we'll heat set it and I can wear this to the craft show. <laughs> so, hey Marilyn, how are you? Did I say hi already? I probably did, but sometimes I'm like, I wanna make sure I say hi. I'd rather give you two highs than none. <laughs> okay, guys, it's super easy. I'm gonna use white. I do have, I do have Dune, but I don't know that I have enough. So I'm just gonna use white, it's gonna really show up. So I'm just gonna put some at the top and then start going down. I'll put some at the top of each of these. It's probably not gonna take as much as I thought, but sometimes it surprises me how the ink will soak into this. So let's just, let's just start. We just have to start somewhere, right? And it slides really easily on these transfers. These new transfers, um, they are, they're just different. The older ones kind of have a bumpy surface and so your your squeegee will catch a little bit. This is really nice, easy peasy. Okay, what's everybody doing today? Today is Saturday. Who has fun plans? I have the craft show. And guys, we're having a blast there. I just love my people. You know, I love my friends there. I love my customers. 
we had we had like a record amount of, of customers yesterday and you know it for spring it was a really good turnout it really was okay heat my heat setter my 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 heat press is like talking to me okay i'm gonna go over it i think that what i have on my squeegee i probably can get that to soak in um fabric it does soak in a little bit i've got the ink mat under there to hold it and also to um protect the surface below okay all right so that can go back in the jar i'm going to go over it one more time and take off any of this excess that also helps press it down through there so ink is permanent guys so i'll be able to wash this shirt over and over and over and it will be permanent on there okay so once i heat set it it is permanent so there's ink and there's chalk okay so you can use the same stencil for both all right i'm just going to put that right there um, make sure you're checking your fingers. You don't want to make this messy. You love the new transfer. I do too. I love this one. Ink and paste. Yes, it's so much easier on them. Absolutely. Um, Deb says, hubby and I are spending the day together having a heat wave. It's supposed to be 68. Oh my gosh, that's funny. Um, you do your doodles got you up at 617, Mary Lee, on your first day of spring break. Not fair. Oh, good goodness. That is not fair. <laughs> Hi, Shelly Holden. How are you? Hi, Sandy Smith. Happy Saturday. Hi, Stephanie. Okay, so then take your corners, guys, and we are just going to peel, and let's make sure we got everything, okay? So the back of this is going to have some fuzzies on it from uh, the shirt. Don't worry. It will all come off. Okay, and that's what those um, letters are supposed to look like. They are distressed like that. That is the, that's the type of font. Look at this. This is cool. I'm going to love wearing this today. So I'm going to heat set this and I will wear this and um, make sure you wash your transfers right away when you use ink on them. So these are reusable over and over and over. I'm going to wash that as soon as I'm done here um, so that I can use it again. Okay, let's dry this. Um, you don't want to get the, the ink mat too hot though. So I'll dry it and then I'll take out the ink mat and I'm going to be checking my fingers making sure I, I didn't get any ink on them. We got too much. Maybe a trip to Target and Hobby Lobby. Oh, that sounds like fun. Cindy, thank you so much for the coffee mug. I showed everybody. So if, if you want to see it again, I can show you. That was so sweet of you. She gave me, those that just hopped on, she gave me this cute coffee mug. I showed it first thing to everybody. And then a cute little card and a gift card to use to fill that. That was so sweet of you. <laughs> a nice little surprise to come home to after my craft show. I hope you're feeling better. I know a lot of people that are really sick. So one of my girls that I was so excited for her to do the show because I had an opening finally, um, she was sick the day of setup and couldn't even get out of bed. So she wasn't able to come and do the craft show. Okay, that's prob this is probably as much as I really want to dry it on the ink mat. Um, <clears throat> so let me see. Oh, Karen, go into Tiffany's and help her prep her garden. Oh, how fun. Having a birthday barbecue tonight. Oh, that's that's a lot of fun. Nice. <coughs> there goes my there goes my little cough. Um, Shelly, yeah, I love this one. I love this shirt. So I don't remember where I got it from. You know how that goes. <laughs> All right, I do have to put I have to put two things under this. So I need to put the mat that I'm going to iron on. Okay, it's kind of like a a portable ironing board, guys. And then I'm going to put a piece of parchment paper to protect the mat, okay? And then I'm gonna take the ink mat out. But I wanna make sure that I put that there because I don't want to iron through and have that ink go onto the ink mat. So I'm just gonna loosen this and take this out. I saw these shirts on an ad on Facebook and had to have it. Okay, I'm gonna dry it just a little bit more because I think it's not quite dry and then we'll heat set it and it'll be done. I can wear it. Wear it to my craft show. Yes, that was so sweet of you. I love, I, you know, you know I love my coffee. <laughs> and guess what, yesterday, guys, oh, it was terrible. I made, I made my breakfast, my oatmeal. I went to put it into a gallon um, Ziploc to take it with me. We didn't have any gallon Ziplocs. I went over to the cupboard to see um, if we had any more in the cupboard. There weren't any, and I got distracted. I left my oatmeal on the counter so my breakfast was sitting on the counter all morning. Okay, I 
I think this edge right here, I think I'm missing like a corner of it. I'm going to use a stylus. I'm going to fill, I think there's supposed to be something right here. So I'm just going to take my stylus, guys, and I'm going to just, I think that it just needs to have something right here. I think it's just missing. So I am just going to paint that in. So you can use a paintbrush, you can use a stylus, whatever you feel like you need to do. I'm just doing that because I felt like there was just something missing on the corner. Okay, now I'm just gonna heat set that corner really quick. Not heat set, I'm gonna dry that corner. And then we'll heat set this, it's that easy guys. And I'll wear this to the cow show. All right, okay, so I'm gonna take my, um, this, I don't know why I always forget what this is. Um, I'm gonna take some of this, <laughs> right. help me out guys I don't know why I can't ever remember the name of this um paper what is this someone help me someone help me okay I'm gonna heat set it so you can use an iron or you can use a heat press I'm using a heat press I'm gonna gonna press my little button this one and it's gonna count down 30 seconds um what is this stuff dang it <laughs> I need to write me a little sticky note because I frequently forget what this is um Tough one. Thank you. Thank you. Why do I forget? Guys, I need a little sticky note to help me. Um, Stephanie says, you're getting shirts at thrift stores with ink and inking on them. That's awesome. I have a friend that does that too. Tough one. Thank you, guys. I know I can count on you. So I always do it at least twice, and I'll test it and see, is it still sticky? If it's still sticky, and this will cover the whole thing, because um, this is the size of the size B transfer. So um, if it is still sticky, I'll do it another time. And my hubby has, um, he has the trailer already hooked up for me. So I just have to get this done, wash my transfer, my squeegee, and I, I can go out, um, out the door. <laughs> so I don't like to rush and we won't have traffic this morning because it is Saturday, which is nice. I don't like that. Um, the Friday traffic wasn't too bad yesterday, but Wednesday and Thursday was a pain in the butt. <laughs> I tell you. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna check it and see if it's sticky. If it's still sticky, then I am, and I'm gonna check it carefully. Okay, it is done, guys. It is done. Okay, I'm gonna take that off. I'm gonna unplug my heat press. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna take out all this stuff here. Okay, I'm gonna set it down here to the side for a moment so I can show you the cutest shirt ever. Isn't it just so cute? I love this. So I'll wear this today over my little black shirt that I have and um, it will be a lot of fun. So um, parchment paper is this. This is the parchment paper. So this is parchment paper, the white stuff. Um, the tough one is the brown stuff. So, and I can't find my roll of parchment paper. It's somewhere. I probably put it in the kitchen to cook with. <laughs> All right, guys, let me just put you up to myself and I will show you just how cute this is going to be. So, um, yeah, look at this. Look at how fun. And I just made a shirt. <laughs> so you too can do this. It's super easy. You saw how easy it was. That's going to be on the back. I'm going to wear this today. Yeah, just like this. I'm going to wear this. I'm going to button up one of the buttons at the bottom or two buttons and um, it'll be so cute over this cute little heart shirt. <laughs> what do you think, guys? I think it's super cute. How's it look? Is it straight? <laughs> or is it crooked? Is it centered? I don't know. I didn't mean for you to see my butt. <laughs> Let me cover up my butt. Let's do that again. Let's do that again. All right. I love it. It is super cute and fun. Um, today's the last day of my cough show. Yes, I tear down at three o'clock. So thanks for being here, guys. I am going to go wash my transfer, wash my squeegee, and I will be out the door. So tomorrow, um, I'll be here at four o'clock. Um, tomorrow I have to go get all the signs down. It takes me three hours to do that. It's a long time. I have to walk to all the, all the stoplights. I have to cross the street, wait for this side. No, I'll go really early. Um, so I don't have to, sometimes the stop stoplights take forever. You know, it just is weird there. There's a lot of traffic on that road, which is good. There's a lot of traffic. So we get a lot of new people, which is great. And then I did an advertisement on Facebook. So people would say, I saw it on Facebook. I'm like, yay, it worked. <laughs> all right. I love my shirt. Um, I will see you guys tomorrow. Hope you have a wonderful Saturday 
Uh, thank you. And we'll have a great rest of our show. Um, it's it's different people. So we know that on Friday, it's all the retired people. Um, and then in the afternoon, it's... <coughs> Sorry. And some people take the day off from work to go shop at the craft show. And then afternoon is people hurrying to get home from work to go. Today is all the families. It's just a whole different crowd on Saturday. So, and people that come back that bring their friends back. So, um, it's going to be a good day. I just know it. <laughs> all right. I love you guys. Have a wonderful day. I will see you tomorrow. Bye.